Uh, hi everybody, Flash Crow here from Old Man Gaming Down Under. Welcome to day 37 of Medieval Dynasty. Today is spring. First day of spring that is. It's a bit cloudy. Not too bad though. Today is tax day, so we have to get into town and pay our taxes. No reason why we should delay, let's get going. I'll see you there. Right, here we are. Just gotta find Unigost. Is that him running away from me? No, I don't believe so. No, here he is. Hmm. Hello, did you come here to pay your taxes? <laughs> uh, yes, here you go. That should cover everything. Splendid. Well, that's the taxes paid. Right, now what I want to do is I want to, want to buy some um, fertilizer and some flax, mm, not flax seed, but flax. So to do that, we need Edwin. Edwin, Edwin, Edwin. Let's check, make sure he wasn't down here. I doubt it. No, he doesn't appear to be. Which means he might be up in the, the top field. Or the top paddock. Can't tell who that is. Ah, Edwin. Yay, hey, Eddie boy. Show me your wares. Right, so I need 32 fertilizer, which is not going to be cheap. We'll buy that. Yeah, okay. Two hundred and forty coin. Then we need sixteen sixteen flax, because we've already got some. And the idea is I'll smash this to bits and uh, get some seed out of it and also end up with some flax stalk. So we'll buy 16 of those. Whoop. I think that's it, mate. Farewell. So, well, how much money does that leave us with? 1,008. Okay, the other thing we're going to do, which I may end up regretting, is to uh, go to Hornica. Did a bit of research, and apparently we can buy a recurve bow there, which of course we need for Alwyn's quest. So I'm just going to mark on the map. It's not exactly close. And the roads, uh, I think I might be brave and just go straight across country. So hopefully that doesn't um, <laughs> cause 
cause too much danger. It probably will. I'll fast forward it, but uh, as always, just before I get eaten, I'll um, let you watch. <laughs> Might get my bow out first. Okay. I'll see you next time. <laughs> I will actually uh, slow this bit down because it's a really nice area. A couple of creeks coming together. Interesting the way the water is coming over the hilltop there. Not quite a waterfall, well, I suppose it is sort of like a waterfall, more like rapids. Very small rapids. Okay, fast forward again. <laughs> Bloody hell. I don't think this was a good idea. Maybe I would have been better off keeping to the track. Maybe I'll do that. Okay, now fast forward again. Oops. <laughs> yeah, well, that's the way I want to go, unfortunately. But, I'm going to have to go the long way. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> game hates me. Um, okay. Right. Run away. And go up the top of this hill. Maybe. It's probably bears up here. <laughs> uh, those deer sure can scare you sometimes. Right, well, not much point speeding this big up, because <laughs> we're here. Gee, they've got them. I was going to say, they've got themselves barricaded in quite well, but I can understand why as well. They've got a few not-so-nice animals around these parts. Right, so I think I'm looking for um, Jan. Jan. No, that's not Jan. Jan. Actually, I might just change the journal story to Alvin's story. Where's Jane gone? She's over there. Hope this is right. Hi, Jane. How do you do? Show me your wares. All right. What's the damage going to be here? Recurve bow, 405. How much do we have? 1,008. Tell you what, if we had a bit more, I'd almost be inclined to buy myself one. They're supposed to be a little bit better than the longbow. Certainly look like it price wise. But I think we'll just buy the one. Um just looking, how much were those as you do arrows?
bronze arrows. Hmm. Is that each? Or for a stack? It's probably each, isn't it? No. Nope, I shall resist the temptation. We've got much bigger things to do. Right. So, our one is back that direction according to the quest. Let me just check the journal, or the map at least. We're facing that way. Yeah, well, must be our one there, maybe. Um, I'll click that as well, just to be on the safe side. Now, I'm a bit worried because the way here was pretty, uh, well, <laughs> scary to say the least. But, I'll try fast forwarding this time. Alwyn, <laughs> here, we have a recurved bow, worthy of a good hunter. Although smaller and easier to carry around than a longbow, it has the same power, if not more. It's the right tool to hunt a wisen. That's, that's really generous of you. However, I still don't know how to track down a wisen. No, you will learn that from Sambor. But I need to know before I have a chance to become his journeyman. Ah, yes, the old problem. What came first, the chicken or the egg? But don't worry. I happen to know where you can find your first impressive game. There is a bison lurking around in the woods north of Boro... 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 Boro Boroo? Anyway, there. It must have its den there. Thank you so much. But do you really think I can do this? Alwyn, the only way to find out is taking a leap of faith and trying it. I know that you can do this. No, I know that you can this. <laughs> Maybe do this. You are right, I can do it. I will do it, today. I've held myself back long enough, but now I really owe you something. Will you visit me when I live in the hunting lodge? Of course I will. And make sure you always have some rabbit stew leftovers. I will, farewell. And here, take those. I won't need them anymore. Ah, oh, thank goodness for that. Let me have a look at my inventory. So, iron hoe, iron scythe. Well, that was a, um, <laughs> that was a real uh, bit of a trial, that one. Let's go back to newcomers, just so that we've got it up there. Right. I think we better head back to the ranch. The sun is getting a bit low in the sky for my liking. All that uh, pussyfooting around trying to uh, not get eaten or stomped on was a um, bit time consuming. I'll see you there. Right, here we are back at our lovely little village. Now, they're plowed ready for the seed and they're plowed ready for the seed. So what I wanna do is make another paddock, same size. The idea is I want to plant 
two fields of flax and one of cabbage. But I think daylight is going to be our biggest enemy, so let's get started. Come over a bit. Two, three, four, two, three, four. Let's do it. Right. Equip our brand new iron hoe number seven and uh, and hit number seven pretty hard to grub grub up the ground with a bow instead of a hoe <laughs> we'll just fast forward this That's it. Now, get some fertilizer down. Press number eight. And field, use the fertilizer. Oops, missed by one. And um, I'll fast forward this as well. like it. Back to number seven. Give it a bit of a plow. Okay, this might not be very successful. It's starting to get very, very dark. Like I said, the uh, Getting the um, bow took a bit too long. Craft. Right, we've got our 16 flax. Here we go. Nice and quick. Maybe we need a torch. Right, give me my cabbage seed. Oh, we only need 16 cabbage seeds. And we don't need any fertilizer. And another 16 flax to go with the 16 that we've already got. I wonder if we can quickly. Oh, goodness gracious me. <laughs> um, yeah, I think it's there, isn't it? I need two straw. Well, I've got to get a drink anyway. I really want to try and get this done today to give us a fresh start tomorrow. But it might depend on... Oh. <laughs> it might depend on how... Um, Now what? What am I trying to say? On how much the uh, thing lights up. Ten straw. I thought I had... Oh, okay. Oh, 
all right. I must be fatigued from all that running. Now, will it let me have it? No, I haven't got it put in a slot. Of course I haven't. Lovely. Is it going to light up enough to make it easy enough to do it? Should be. Oh, hang on. I'm not going to be able to use it in... No. Do you know what? We've done enough today. But when we get up in the morning, we can do a bit of sewing. Do I have any meat on me? I'm a bit hungry. I've got two. Oh, I've got... Goodness. Um, let me eat these. I'm going to put that meat in the food. Okay, thank you for that. How much poison is that meat? 20% poisoning. Okay, well I'll keep it on me because it goes off quicker when I'm carrying it rather than if it's in storage. So, I'll let that turn to rot. It's a good night, John boy. <laughs> I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.